One of the highlights of Mazda's 2010 model year changes is the CX-7. First introduced in 2006, this small crossover receives a smaller engine option, helping it to better compete in the tough CRV Escape RAV4 world. In addition to the previously available 2.3-liter Turbo 4, front-drive CX-7 models can now be equipped with a more miserly, naturally aspirated 2.5-liter four-cylinder and a five-speed automatic transmission. This takes gas mileage from the Turbo's premium fuel-recommended 17-city 23 highway to the base model's 20-city 28 highway. I recently drove both models and was surprised to see that the 161 horsepower and matching amount of torque from this smaller engine was enough to keep it from feeling sluggish. It works hard climbing hills, but shows no signs of inadequacy. It's a bummer you can't get it with all-wheel drive, but then again, the added 300 pounds of that model would likely be the tipping point for too much weight, too little power. The front and rear dampers have been retuned for 2010 to assist in greater ride comfort, handling, and stability, combined with lower NVH levels. Indeed, the CX-7 conforms to Mazda's fun-to-drive Zoom Zoom mantra, giving small SUV shoppers a driver's alternative to the numbing competitors. The turbo model is especially enjoyable, with 244 horses and gobs of torque to give the CX-7 the power its agile chassis was designed for. My biggest complaint with the earlier model was in the interior, but that too has been addressed with a marked step up in quality, feel, and appearance. The small Navi screen is controlled at the wheel, a la the Mazda 3, but it's not as limiting as it looks. It actually works pretty well for basic functions. The CX-7's exterior gets refreshed as well, with a front end in step with its siblings. Pricing for the base front-wheel drive ISV starts at $22,300, while a stocked all-wheel drive S Grand Touring can run you into the mid-30s. So now there's a CX-7 for a wide range of tastes and wallets. It's a great option if you want your sport you to be more than just an appliance. For Drive Time on Yahoo Autos, I'm Steve Hammes.